And, but you know, the most, the, one of the most things, common things that I hear about this subject is that the way it makes them feel. It just feels good to do this. I just feel closer to God. I feel like a Christian when I speak in tongues or in a language or in some cases it's not even a language, but it just makes them feel good. Now you do know back in the 70s when the charismatic movement was a big thing, they, and this is actually a, a, a something that occurred back then, back in the 70s, they sent bilingual men and women out to these different congregations of these groups that were speaking in tongues, just to sit there and to listen to what was going on. And one of the reports that they most commonly came back with was that, yeah, it was a language. Now get this, these bilingual men and women who went to these different churches back in the 70s, to these charismatic movements where they're speaking in tongues, they actually came back and said, yeah, it was a language. We understood what was being said. But what was coming out of their mouths, in many cases, was the most vile, filth, and cursing they had ever heard in their life. Now, I'm asking you, what spirit was that? You know the answer to that question. Did it make them feel good? Oh yeah, it made them feel good, yeah. I'm sure the people that were speaking in this gibberish or whatever it was, a different language, in this case, they said they documented that in many cases it was a language. In some cases, it was just a gibberish that no one could understand. It was not a language. But in many cases, it was a language, and what was coming out of our, their mouths was filth. Now, you've got to deal with this fact. What spirit is a person under when they speak in an unknown language? or as people like to refer to it, an unknown language, which that's an error there. The, you know, the word unknown was added in the King James. It's, in, it's in italicized, which means it was added. It's not an unknown language. It's a language, you know, that, that it's a different dialect. Okay, here's what you gotta understand about the speaking in tongues. No real gift of the Holy Spirit is self-serving. 